my hair is a mess. Okay. Ah, it could cause you more harm than good. Absolutely trash. Okay, I'm ready to oil my hair. Someone in this room has not been taking care of her hair. It's me. I don't know if you can tell, but my hair is a mess. It's a huge mess. Look at all the split ends, dead ends. It just looks so dry and frizzy. My hair looks crazy. So I have decided to try this new hair care trend that has been going on on TikTok for a while now. And that is applying oil to your ends every single night. Now I'm not really sure how this is gonna work, but I have a positive feeling about this challenge. I feel like we could achieve really great results by doing that because I am a huge fan of oiling. If you know, you know, if you're brown, that oiling your hair is essential when you are brown. Okay, that's how we have beautiful hair. Clearly, not me because I haven't been taking care of my hair, but I'm going to oil my hair every single night. So I'm not going to oil my roots, but I will be oiling my ends every single night. So let's see what happens. Hopefully, my hair changes overnight or within the course of the seven days that I'm going to do this challenge, but I'm hoping for great results. So now you must be wondering, what oil am I going to use? So I have this Vatica oil over here, but I also have Moroccan oil. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to apply both of these oils, Vatica oil on this end and Moroccan oil on this end. We can test out Vatica versus Moroccan oil as well. You know, two challenges in one. At the end of the day, I just want to get rid of these split ends, frizzy, dry, ugly ass hair. So wish me luck. Let's see how this goes. Okay guys, so it is day one of me oiling my hair. Let me just comb out my hair first because a lot of tangles as you can see. By the way you guys, when you are combing your hair, always start with the ends first instead of like the roots. It'll avoid your hair from falling and it's good for your roots. And it's so much more easier because look what happens when you don't. You see? Look at this. Oh my goodness. Absolutely trash. Okay, I'm done with one side. Hopefully my hair does not fall out. So I have oiled my hair. I'm done with day one. Okay guys, so I haven't washed my hair yet, but my hair is kind of looking better today. Maybe it's just me being delusional, but I honestly feel like it looks way better than it did yesterday. And I haven't washed my hair yet, so I still have the oil on, but I'm gonna oil my hair anyways. Okay, so my hair has been on a bun for the entire day today, and I had very less tangles, which is just amazing. By the way, you guys, if you are someone who washes their hair almost every single day, don't do it. Just don't do it, because that is not good for your hair. You do not want to strip away the natural oils that your head produces, because they are good for us. So I'm oiling the ends. I'm so tired of these cats disturbing me all the time. Okay, so I am done with day two. This is how my hair looks. Can I go out with this hair on a normal day? I think I can, but after a few hours anyways, my hair won't be looking very oily. So I could definitely go out in the morning because I do have a few errands to run tomorrow morning. So hopefully my hair won't be looking like this tomorrow. Okay guys, so it is day three. It is high time I washed my hair. I haven't washed my hair yet, but as you can see, my hair does look a little better than it did on day one. Let me just comb it out. Okay, I'm ready to oil my hair. You guys, even if you won't be able to do this challenge every single day, please at least oil your hair twice a week, like your entire head along with your roots and your ends. Trust me, oiling is just amazing. Doesn't matter how you do it. It's just really good for your hair. And especially at this age and time, we are women. We need to start taking care of our hair properly, correctly, and very frequently. So make sure you are taking care of your hair no matter what, because trust me, you don't wanna be bald by the age of 35 or 40. So take care of your hair. Have you ever seen a brown grandma without hair? Like anywhere in the world, you would see a lot of old people with 
little to no hair at all but if you go to an asian country india pakistan sri lanka arab countries you will see a lot of us our grandmas our old people even our granddaddies they have a lot of hair on their heads you know why because they oil their hair they take care of their hair so please oil your hair do it for yourself did you guys know that over oiling your hair is really bad i know you must have heard oil your hair oil your hair oil your hair all of these beauty gurus asking you to oil your hair but if you over oil your hair it could cause you more harm then good so make sure you do not over oil your hair all the time because you could clog your hair follicles that could cause hair breakage as well as dandruff and you do not want that okay so i have been oiling my hair with one moroccan oil as well as vatica oil but i use it in the small container and i haven't washed my hair in four days so all I can say is Moroccan oil works way better because it makes my hair look less oily in about 4 hours but like on the other hand Vatica oil it makes my hair look super oily even like in the morning when I wake up as you can see I feel like my split ends look way better now not that split ends can look better but like it just looks less damagey you get what I mean? okay guys it is day 5 and this is what my hair looks like look at this I don't know if you guys could tell, but there is some kind of improvement. Obviously, also because of the fact that I haven't washed my hair in five days. The last time I washed my hair was when I started this challenge. So, yeah. But as you can see, my hair looks so much better. And just look at it. It doesn't look that oily, but it does look dirty on the roots. So, I'll probably wash my hair today. Like, definitely, I have to. But, like, damn, look at this. No tangles, nothing. Like... Nothing. No tangles at all. Zero tangles. Okay guys, I must say, I would definitely recommend you guys applying oil onto your ends before you go to bed so you wake up with smooth silky hair but since i'm home all the time like i can do it anytime i want but like if you go to work or you go to school or you have to be somewhere else in the morning definitely do it at night while you're asleep you know let the oil do the magic at night okay you guys it is day six of oiling my end ah so if you're wondering if i actually cleaned my hair the answer is no I decided to just wait it out, let me surprise myself after a shower. I did not wash my hair for ever since I started this challenge. So yeah, I'm just gonna wash it by the end of this challenge, just look at the difference because it's already oily. Because here's the thing, I have a shower routine and the day I have to show the results does not fall on the same day as my shower routine day. So I'm just gonna live with this dirty hair until the challenge is done we only have one more day to go so that's just that by the way you guys if you think that oiling your hair will get rid of your split ends that is so not true you cannot repair split ends that's just the ugly truth either you have to trim it or what you can do is reduce the appearance of it but you cannot get rid of split ends once it's already there once your ends have splits you can't like stick it back together okay i'm just like being honest with y'all you ever see a video on youtube saying that it'll get rid of your split ends absolutely not whenever they say get rid of your split ends it usually means it makes your split ends look less visible and that's about it you cannot fix something that's broken already so okay you guys it is the last day so finally we are done with this challenge i can wash my hair so let's do this okay you guys so i finally washed my hair this is what my hair looks like amazing okay now let's talk about it would i repeat this challenge would i do this for the rest of my life absolutely not oiling your hair every single day i'm not really sure about that but i'll probably oil my ends every other day 
just my ends because look at how my hair looks right now look at this that is great progress I love the way my hair looks right now this challenge definitely worked but I'm not gonna do it every single night instead I'll be doing it every other day honestly I would give this challenge a 8 out of 10 or a 9 out of 10 absolutely love it my hair was way more frizzier way more I don't know it just looked way more damaged than it does right now I mean look at this I just got out of the shower and my hair dried up and look at how beautiful shiny like just wow just my hair just looks amazing I mean look at this wow okay absolutely love it so yeah that is it for this video i hope you guys enjoyed this video and i hope that you guys found this video helpful please leave a comment down below if you found this video helpful and if you have any other recommendations i would love love to read them so yeah i'll see you guys in my next video Bye bye